You have seven seconds to get somebody's attention and convince them to tune in or to tune out from what you're saying, whether it's video content or in person. And within those seven seconds, you can choose to waste their time and effectively kick them out the door or to draw them in and tell them why this is going to be valuable to them. So keep in mind, as you're having conversations with people, we're very selfish. We want things focused on us. What benefits us? What gives value to us? What interests us? If it doesn't do those things for us, we're probably not going to pay as close attention. We are going to be focused on things that work to our benefit. So if you start a conversation, a video, or whatever with your traits and why people should pay attention to you and who you are and what you do, you've already lost that audience. They don't care about your credentials and they don't care about how this is going to be valuable to you. They want to know what is going to impact them. So instead of starting it off with an introduction or telling your credentials or talking about what you've done in the past and how you can help them, you're actually going to tell them something valuable, some piece of information that is going to catch their attention and say, oh, I need to know this. Which is why when we talk about creating videos or doing live streams or speaking in a public presentation on a stage at a convention or just meeting somebody in an elevator as you're passing by, we tell you to start with that value. We always start videos with a hook. At the beginning of this video, I told you, you have seven seconds to get people's attention to get them to either tune in or to tune out. Now, if I had started by telling you all of my credentials and all the ways that I can help you because I'm an expert in X, Y, and Z, would you have stayed to listen to me? Probably not. But because we're talking about how to get people's attention and keep it, you stopped so that you could get those tips. So when you are having a conversation with someone, tell them something that benefits them and then reinforce that and back it up. And you know what? Eventually you can tell them who you are and your credentials and all the things and reasons why they should be listening to you. That stuff is powerful, but it's not the most important thing you can be sharing. So when you start any conversation, whether it is a conversation, a live stream, a video on TikTok or Instagram, or you're an in-person speaker at a con or an event, make sure you lead with what is the most powerful thing for them. And that is the benefit, value, and educational resources for them. Always put them first. When you put other people first in the conversation, they're going to stick around for it. And if you put yourself first, they probably won't. If you've got questions on this, drop it down below and stick around for more.